the host of the Jennifer Hudson Show, the lovely and talented Jennifer Hudson. Now, you grew up uh, in the church. Yes. Obviously, you've got a deep gospel roots, but I just found out that for all the singing you did, and how early did you start? Uh, well, my first solo was at seven, but I did not start singing with my eyes open until I was 19. That's what I wanted to ask you about. Yes. You did not <laughs> keep your eyes open until you were 19. Why and what was that like? Because I had stage fright. So I would beg for a solo in church. But you'd go out with your eyes closed? Oh, yes. Because I didn't, I couldn't look at people. And even when I'm acting, you know, I look at the floor because then everybody on the production would just be feet versus people because, you know, that's a whole audience. So sometimes it's intimidating. Right. So growing up in church, well, first of all, you know, you know, you sing, you know, from within and from a certain place. So it's more internal. So I was singing with my eyes closed and then we wasn't allowed to perform. I didn't start performance in America. I, I was like, performing? Well, what happened to just standing singing a song? So <laughs> when I was 19, that's when I started singing with my eyes open. And at one minute, I, when I closed my eyes, everybody was like, oh, Jenny can't sing. And then when I finished, I, I looked up and everybody was giving me a standing ovation. And after that, that broke that fear. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> I'm curious. You made an interesting distinction that you made an interesting distinction there between singing and performing. Mm -hmm. What's the difference? Well, whew, I mean, you know, when you perform, you are exuding energy out. You're connecting and, and you know, with people and the audience. But then singing, well, at least singing in church for me, yeah, yeah. it's more internal. You but know, could you, it's more could introverted. Could you sing the exact same song that sort of sounded the same to a layman, but you know that one of those is performing and one of them is singing? Is, because you don't have to physically do anything else with your body to be performing. It's right. just something, some intention that you have? Yeah. I mean, I guess it's a way of, com a different way of communicating, you know, versus, um, like, when you are internal, you, you stay within yourself and it's more intimate and it's come from a certain space, um, whereas you're allowing people in mm -hmm. when you are performing. And it's all about the energy. You Do know you ever mean? go back to that internal form of performance? Oh, yes. Or, I mean, the internal form of singing as opposed to performance? Definitely. I mean, that's the base, because I don't consider myself as a performer. I'm a singer. You know what I mean? Oh, I see. So, I mean, You're a pretty it's... good performer, too. Thank I'm sorry you. to tell you. <laughs> I have hard news but for you. But that's the newest part! That's it's the not me part. saying it. It's, it's, <laughs> Thank you. it's these people saying it, not me. <laughs> now, I, I understand that one of the traditions that you have on your new show is you have a new mug every day. Yes. And what's the why, why that? Because, I mean, okay, so when I get up in the morning, I always have just my little spit of coffee, right? And in and, and a little cup. So each one has a different saying. And whatever I feel I need, like I need a cup of peace, or I need a cup of love, I need mm -hmm. a cup of whatever it is I need, and I pick that cup. Mm -hmm. And that's what I drink out of. And so it's like an affirmation, it's inspiration, you know? So I recommend it for everyone. Find well, your, what that inspiration that you At some point in the need. future, would be so honored if you would take a late show on mine. There you go, take that with you. Add it to the collection. I need a cup of Mr. Cooper. A cup. <laughs> I love it. Jennifer, lovely Thank to you. see you. Thank you. The Jennifer Hudson Show airs weekdays nationwide. Jennifer Hudson, everybody. We'll be right back with actress Sasha Mamet.